Welcome to another episode of Gone Again and in today's video I'd like to talk to you about the benefits of a swinging knife sheath. Stick around. There's pros and cons to a swinging knife sheath. Some people like them and some people don't. One benefit is when you sit down the knife automatically swings out of the way. If it's attached to your belt, it usually wants to dig into whatever it is you're sitting on. This is really handy. I think one of the main reasons for its existence is for hikers and hunters who wear a uh, pack that has a waist belt on it. You know, the belt supports the weight of your pack. But uh, with a swinging loop like this, swinging loop sheath like this, uh, the knife hangs below that belt instead of being right underneath it, whereas we're, that's where it would be normally if it was just strung up on your belt. So this is extremely handy. Another thing I like about it is that it's easier to get the knife in and out. Instead of blindly searching like this trying to put my knife back in, you know you feel with your fingertip up here and you're trying to put it back in the sheath, with a swinging sheath like this, I can pull it around the front and I can clearly see what I'm doing and put my knife away. And if you're wearing a knife that doesn't have a swinging loop and you have a body that's shaped like mine, or even if you're a curvy woman, when you attach the knife to your belt sheath, I mean to your belt, the sheath to your belt, it points out away from your body like this and it's always snagging on things. But the same knife sheath, knife sheath with the swinging loop on it tends to point in. And if you do come up against something, it just brushes out of the way. I think it's handy. I like it. It was my wife's idea to begin with, and I've done it on all our knife sheaths. Pretty easy to do. Here you can see the original knife sheath. And these rings, you can find them on Amazon. I think these are one and a half inch. These are one and a half inch rings, and they're for um, scuba diving. And like I got like a half a dozen of them for under ten dollars. And they're split rings, so it's easy to modify an existing sheath. All you need to do is make this loop. I, you can hand sew it very easily. I riveted it, and uh, there's. I have a video on how to do this riveting. Uh, it's a uh, one where I made an axe sheath. But each one has been modified like that. From the existing sheath to a swinging loop. And of course if you want to wear the uh, knife sheath the regular way, you just let the loop hang down and you can go through the original sheath here. If you like the video, please like, share, and subscribe and see you around.